Here are two factors that could have contributed to the catastrophic collapse of a Baltimore bridge this morning, according to Northeastern Professor of Civil Engineering, Jerome Hajar. First, the bridge was completed in 1977, and at the time, the loads of commercial vessels were significantly less, meaning it's possible that the bridge may not have been designed to anticipate the risks posed by ever larger commercial shipping vessels. Second, Hajar says that the most common cause of bridge failure is scouring, or when the soil around the bridge's foundation erodes. This erosion could create conditions that even even a light cargo load by modern standards would cause a support structure to collapse, and this definitely was not a light load. But Hajar also says that it's definitely possible that there was nothing deficient with the bridge, not when you take a force as large as a container ship and smash it into its support. 